Well, first of all, the United Nations Charter, which is kind of a world constitution. Now, this charter prohibits the use of force. Article 2, Paragraph 4. This charter also requires peaceful negotiations. Russia has been engaged in peaceful negotiations asking for a uh, Europe-wide security architecture. And unfortunately, notwithstanding the uh, two treaties drafted uh, by Moscow, they were rejected uh, out of hand by uh, Jens Stoltenberg and also by my president, uh, Joe Biden. Article 2, paragraph 4 of the UN Charter prohibits not only the use of force, and certainly the use of force uh, by Russia on o Ukraine is not excusable. It entails a violation of the UN Charter. This very same article prohibits the threat of the use of force. And NATO has been threatening with the use of force nonstop. It's been provoking. It's been bringing in tons and tons of uh, military equipment and ammunition into Ukraine. I reject the idea of preemptive uh, self-defense. Self-defense under the UN Charter is only allowed after a military attack.